honest review. Um, but I wanted to do a review on this. So I've been using this. Um, so this is the bottle. I'm probably like right here in the bottle. So it's not. Ha it's a little more than halfway um, used or whatever. So this is the Nivea Essentially Enriched with Deep Nourishing Serum in Almond Oil. It's supposed to be for 24 hour body, uh, moisture body lotion. It intensely nourishes dry to very dry skin. So let's get into it. Um, and so one of the things I'll say too, if you have heard of Nivea, if you do remember like back in the day, Nivea used to be like, you know, if you had dry skin, this is Nivea. So one of the things, so I wanted Nivea because my skin's been a little bit dry. So when I saw it, I'm like, okay, let me try it. But the, here's the issue. When I was in the store, I think I went to Walmart. It was more, like it was so many options. I'm like, dang, like Nivea just got all these options now. So I remember just a blue bottle. I remember, I don't think they had multiple uh, options of lotion to choose from. who has been subscribed to my channel um i was in puerto rico and i got a little bit of sunburn and like ever since i came back my skin has been like super itchy so i'm like let me get something to um to kind of soothe that or whatever so i've been using the nivea i will say from the brag that was back in the day where people were saying it's, it's so great i don't necessarily feel that i will say it is very moisturizing um so i like it this is um hmm, i think i might include this in my world's best series where i do like world's best so like is this the world's best moisturizing body lotion let's get into it so So like inside, you know, secret, like I feel like my feet have been a little bit dry lately. So probably because I'd be walking around with no socks on. But I thought this was going to solve my problems on my like the back of my feet, my heel. It's not bad. It's really not bad. But um, it's not, it's okay. I would say this is okay. I feel like for me knowing like my young, my little Gen Zers out there who um, don't really know about the, the Nivea back in the day y'all might not you know it might not hit the same but for me it's like i thought I, I had high expectations for this and i will say it's okay one of the things i do not like and this is not a bash video but i just all of my review videos can't be great right like i don't like I, this is not a fake channel like everything is my honest review like everything is my honest review most of the time i'm paying i'm buying these things myself paying for them. here and there like two percent of the time somebody might send me something but in those in those situations i will let y'all know i don't just be like faking like oh i bought this no i will tell y'all somebody sent me something but yeah i just bought this because i was you know looking for a resolution and this is why i share these things on my channel because i'll try it for y'all and you know kind of give y'all my opinion because i think that's helpful when i'm shopping for stuff i usually like hit up the reviews, TikTok, YouTube, Instagram, all those things and try to collect the, you know, do, create an analysis of like, okay, is this good? Is it not? Should I buy it? Should I not? So this right here, I, I would say it's good. Like, I think it helps. It can help with dry skin and, you know, making your body feel moisturized and your skin can feel rich. Like my, my skin is looking soft and glowy, right? I ain't got no muscle, but I got on my Glam Marina sports bra make sure y'all check out glam marina this is my active wear brand if you haven't already i'm going to show you how to back this is our melanin collection one of our sports bras the logo i designed myself 
it's um the uh africa the shape of africa with a woman's face coming out of it as africa being her hair i actually designed that myself i have a graphic design background for those who don't know don't try to steal it because it is trademarked um but anyway i think that this right here is good to a certain extent i just don't think it's I don't think that it's solving all your problems because it says intensely nourishes dry to very dry skin. I think that marketing right there is a little like over, uh, you know, it's a little more than what it actually is. Another thing I don't like, which I feel like some shea butters do this too, is um, is a really, it leaves your skin feeling like really oily instead of like, getting into your skin and like like i don't know just like even right now with my hands the, my hands are so oily and i don't like that like i want something to get on my skin and sit in it and not like leave stains on my clothes um so that's another thing i don't like i just feel like my expectations were high for the nivea brand especially like the blue bottle because that's like the nostalgic um vibe and i feel like for me it's I don't know if I will buy it again to be honest like I don't know I'll see like I'm only like barely halfway through the bottle but I don't know I'll, I'll see I will say as far as the itchiness that my skin has been feeling when I take a shower and I exfoliate and then I put this on I do feel a little bit soothed a little bit relieved um but not like for 48 hours I feel like it's like a temporary thing like maybe overnight and then the next morning I feel like I gotta you know reapply so i don't know let me know what y'all think have y'all tried this before have you you know what are your thoughts on it i know some people have done reviews on one of the nivea uh moisturizers that is in the light tan bottle i haven't tried that i'm just you know trying to figure out nivea i'm more of a natural girly like um like i said shea butters oils and stuff like that but i wanted to share this with y'all because I think it is, you know, when we think about self-care, about our soft girl era or our soft boy era, if my guys are watching this video, like, I'm really big on that this year. Like, I've been preaching it in, like, every single video that as adults and also for my black people out there, like, for black people, it's very hard for us right now. It's hard for everybody, so I don't want to call it out as, a, like, a, a race thing or whatever. Or ethnicity thing but it's just hard as an adult in America it is hard right now the economy is crazy it's just so many things going on so I always I just been preaching all year to like live your best life do whatever you gotta do to live a beautiful life because for me like I have a child But like I guess I show it well I carry it well but I'd be so stressed so that's why I'm doing all these videos and trying all these products because I want stuff in my toolkit my self-care toolkit I want to be able to be home and feel like I'm in luxury I don't want to have to go out I don't want to be always out like um I know there was a moment in my life where and I can't remember where I wanted to be at somebody else's house. I wasn't comfortable at home or, you know, I wasn't inspired at home. But for, for the type of person I am, the creator that I am, I need to always constantly feel inspired, feel at peace, um, to be able to continue to push through and be successful and, and show up for the people that I need to show up for. So stuff as little as like moisturizing my skin. Some people may think it's crazy. Some may, people may think like, mm, how is that relevant? It's really relevant because if I feel uncomfortable, right, it's a chain effect. It's like, 
I'm walking around mad, I'm walking around bitter, um, I'm walking around stressed, and I then I can't really be my full self, and I'm, I'm not living a happy life, which leads to some of the craziness that happens in this world. So I'm super big on that. So if you are into that, if you like that type of stuff, subscribe to my channel because all my content is about to be about living your best life, living a beautiful life, and I like for my skin to be moisturized, point blank period. This is helpful. I just I just think the marketing is a little bit dramatic. I think it's a little bit deceiving, just a little bit. Like it moisturizes your skin, but 24 hour moisturizer, nah. I don't think so. Not 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 when they're saying for dry to very dry skin. Like if you have like normal to dry skin, maybe it will be a 48 48 hour moisturizer. But if your skin is like really dry, you're having a dry moment, like it's saying, I don't, I don't, for me, it's not giving 48 hours. It's giving like maybe a few hours overnight. Um, and again, I have a little bit of sunburn. My skin is dry from being in the sun for too long. And yeah, so I don't know. Let me know what y'all think. Is this the world's best moisturizing body lotion? Does it last 48 hours for you if you've tried it? Have you considered trying it? You know, let me know in the comments. Um, thanks so much for watching this video. Remember, live a beautiful life no matter what. Do whatever you have to do to find peace, peace of mind, happiness, because we got one life to live. If we work so hard and, you know, die trying to live that life, like, is it really worth it? You know, how can we show it for ourselves? How can we show it for our people? So yes, live a beautiful life and I will see y'all in my next video.